Now, fellas, real quick. Don't listen to her. You know, if, if 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 you know what's best, don't listen to her. Don't even take this type of advice, right? You know what I mean? Glorilla says she's cool with going 50-50 with her man and shares her reason. This is like the biggest L as a man you could take, man. Going 50 50 with your woman. I'm going to tell you why. Let me run this intro real quick. Do, do. What's good? What's going on, man? It's your boy B, and we back in this mud with another video, man. We got Glow Ritter out here saying, you know what I'm saying? Telling people they should, or she don't mind. She's cool with going 50 50. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, when you got like celebrities and artists rapping stuff like that, you got kids and. Some adults, they look up to you. So they seeing this right here, thinking it'd be a cool idea. 50-50, right? Nah. Here's why 50-50 is not cool as a man going 50-50 with your woman, right? First thing. If you go 50-50 with your woman, no one, who who's going to be the leader? You know what I mean? Who's going to be the leader? Say something happens. Say if you you lose your job, y'all were going fifty fifty. You lose your job, man. She gotta go a hundred. You know what I mean? How long that's gonna last? And shout out, to, look, man. Shout out to Fresh and Fit. I watched them all through too, man. If y'all watch Fresh and Fit, let me know in the comments, man. Um, fifty fifty. As a man, you should you should be able to provide. We're gonna check. We're gonna play the video and we're gonna read some comments too, man. We're gonna elaborate on those as well. But as a man, you should be able to provide for your family, your kids, whatever, etc. Whatever you got going on, you should be the leader, man. not splitting bills with your woman. Because when you split bills with your woman, or whatever, when 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 a situation erupts or e e evolves or something like that happens. She gon' she gonna be talking shit to you, huh? You know what I mean? Like you really ain't got too much. You can't. You ain't got too much say. So your nuts not even big enough. But you going fifty fifty, you know? You can't say get out. You can't say leave the house. She paying too. <laughs> Ah, uh, let's check this video out, man. Let's check the video out, man. I can't even hear nothing. It's playing through the headphones. All right, let's see what she got to say. Hello again. And morning info, you know, I do, I'm starting to do it a lot. I think it might be something I get used to. But this is a topic that I'd never spoke on before that may ruffle a lot of feathers. And, you know, some people may want to fight about it. But it's the topic on the 50-50 with a relationship. Me, personally, I feel like you supposed to go 50-50 with your nigga because if a nigga just gets you to the point where, like, you just feel like you don't got to do nothing, like, he going to make you lazy and shit. And as a woman, you should want to have your own shit going. You shouldn't want it to be where if a nigga leave you today, he was paying all the bills, and now you got this big-ass weight on your shoulders. She finished. You should Yeah. All right, so we're going to touch down on a few things that she spoke on, man. Um, <laughs> it's right here funny to me, man. This right here is funny as hell to me, man. So she spoke on about going 50-50 and that uh, you should want to go 50-50 with your man because if you don't, it's going to make you lazy. Um, honestly, I I feel like that's just an excuse, man. You know what I mean? You got to keep it 100. If you ain't paying no bills, you, you can find something else to do to be productive, right? 
So that right there debunks that. What else she what else she say? What else she it's say? It's a bit with your nigga because if a nigga just gets you to the point where like you just feel like you don't gotta do nothing, like he gonna make you lazy and shit, and as a woman you should wanna have your own shit going. You should I mean, ain't nothing. Let's get this clear out the way. Ain't nothing wrong with having your own your own stuff going. Your own, you know what I'm saying. You might have your own little business. You making your own money. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Not nothing. But it's a lot wrong with going fifty fifty with your man because right there it automatically knocks him out the leadership role of him splitting bills fifty fifty. You know what I mean? Automatically knocks him out the leadership role. He ain't got much. He ain't got no say. So after you go, you go fifty fifty. We ain't got much to say. Both of y'all <laughs> even. I don't want it to be where if a nigga leave you today, he was paying all the bills, and now you got this big ass weight on your shoulders. And that and that right there. Okay, I can understand where she coming from from that perspective right there. Okay, you you ain't paying nothing. You know what I mean? You ain't working nowhere right there. That's on you. He kick you out. That, that's on you again. I mean, ain't nothing wrong. Like I said, ain't nothing wrong making your own money to where you can be able to provide for yourself. But as, if you with a man, he he's supposed to be the provider, man. A long story short, he's supposed to be the provider, man. But anyways, man, let's read some of these comments, man. See what they saying. Uh, we got S. Dot. He said, uh, well, I was taught. Well, I was taught not to go 50-50 because a man is the man in the house and he's supposed to provide. Imagine going to a restaurant and having to split the bill with her because that 50-50 rule. Come on, son. Nigga, nobody care what you were taught. <laughs> I crazy, man. Uh, if y'all just boyfriend and girlfriend shaking up, 50-50 should be the way to go. If y'all married, both working, I'll say it should be 725 financially. But when kids are involved, you got to do 100-100 on both sides. <laughs> Honestly, I just I just all do I I believe that it just all depends on the uh on the, on on how much how much nigga make him, man. You know, for real, for real. If if if, if he got it like that, and, and you know if if talk, talking with his, if a nigga got got his girl and he got it, he not gonna ask her, he not even gonna have her paying no type of bills whatsoever. Fifty fifty gonna he probably gonna look at her stupid as hell. 50-50? I mean, he got it already. And let's be honest, not too many females going to even go 50-50. And if they do, how long it's going to last? Huh? Because nine times out of ten, their money is their money. When it's your money as a man, it's our money. Think about that, man. Let that sink in, man. For the majority, for the majority of the population, man. For the majority of the population, not many women will be going 50 50 with their man. They want the man to be the one who's providing, leading, and spending the majority of the money on the bills. He taking care of the bills. She take care of the crib, whatever. May get some groceries here and there. But, like, far as like the big dog bills, the, 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 the ones that's going to. Yeah, put a big impact on your account. Yeah, that fifty fifty did, man. It ain't gonna last long, man. Uh, let's see what some of the females are saying. I rather that same woman complaining they won't go fifty fifty with a man be single forever, going a hundred hundred. Uh, these comments, man, forgot how to be a man these days. It's tragic. I do feel like women should always have their own and have safety net, but going half and half with a man, man. Release this thank you from the black community. <laughs> yeah, I yeah, I, I agree with her. I agree with Shawty right here. Asia, I agree with her, man. Um Nah facts, I know bad red bone shit that you would think is bougie, but not at all. She grew up in the gutter, so she understands how hard life can be. She's not materialistic or none, just chill and pretty. That's good. that'll be hard to find though nowadays in our society, bro, in the day market, bro. Like Trying to find one of a female that's not really materialistic. Cause they say they're not materialistic, but you go, you, you go, you go to the store and you bring them back some bullhead. You know, yeah, all right. But she ain't materialistic. 
uh, even if you go 50-50 with your man, he can still say, I pay rent here too, and be on some, I'm not leaving tight shit. Then it's still a huge weight on your shoulders because you stress because you don't want to be with this nigga no more. Either way, it's a lady. Either way, as a lady, have your own money. What? What did I just read? Let me read it. Let me read this again, bro. I pay rent here too, and be on so I'm not leaving tight shit. Then it's still a huge weight on your shoulders. So she said, she looking at the situation like, okay, things didn't work out. Oh, uh, but we playing fifty fifty on stuff. But he ain't one. He ain't trying to leave. He ain't got nowhere to go. It's just a whole bunch of stuff can evolve. It's just going 50 50, bro. <laughs> I just know that. Just keep it 100, man. But anyway, man, y'all comment y'all thoughts and opinions below about this whole situation, man. Uh, Glorilla. Like, she done spooked the internet. She got the trending on Twitter. Y'all know I had to come check it out. But, anyways, man, appreciate y'all checking out the video with me, man. Uh, watching the video. Uh, be sure to check out one of the videos at the end of the screen because it's definitely a banger. I would miss it if I was you, man. Catch y'all next video, man. 50-50. <laughs> Nigga, you better not, bro.